Hi, today we are going to learn about money problems. Money is the means of paying for something or buying something. It is in the form of coins or notes. There are four different operations that we'll be using for this. Those are addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. Now, how can we use different operations in the context of money? Let's learn this with the help of an example. First one is addition. Let's say Macy has 15 pounds and Kitty has 27 pounds. Now how much money do they have all together? Amount of money with Macy is equal to 15 pounds. Amount of money with Katie is equal to 27 pounds. Here the word all together suggests to add the amounts. Therefore the total amount would be 15 pounds added to 27 pounds that is equal to 42 pounds. Next is subtraction. Let's say Ella has 35 pounds and spends 28 pounds on books. How much money is left with Ella? Here amount of money with Ella is 35 pounds. Amount of money she spent on books is equal to 28 pounds. Here the keyword is how much money is left. So we'll use subtraction. Therefore, amount of money left would be 35 pounds take away 28 pounds that is equal to 7 pounds. Next is multiplication. What is the cost of 5 chocolates if the cost of 1 chocolate is 60 pence? Here cost of 1 chocolate is equal to 60 pence. Now to know the cost of 5 chocolates, we will simply multiply the cost of 1 chocolate by 5 as we are finding the total and the price of all the chocolates is the same. Therefore, cost of 5 chocolates is equal to 60 pence times 5, which is equal to 300 pence. We can also convert 300 pence into pounds if the question asks to answer in pounds. As we know that 1 pound is equal to 100 pence, therefore 300 pence would equal to 300 divided by 100 that is equal to 3 pounds. Next is division. Let's say Shen bought 4 shirts of same price. In total she spent 48 pounds on shirts. What is the amount of money spent by Shannon on one shirt? Here the total amount of money spent by Shannon is equal to 48 pounds. Number of shirts is equal to 4. Now to find the amount of money spent on one shirt we will divide 48 by 4. Therefore price of one shirt would be 48 divided by 4 that is equal to 12 pounds. Now let's try a question. JC says that she has collected 105 pounds in 7 weeks. How much amount of money is saved each week if the amount of money saved is the same each week? Here the total amount of money is equal to 105 pounds. Number of weeks is equal to 7. The amount of money saved each week would be 105 divided by 7 which is equal to 15 pounds.